Hi, back again um, for the second box that I got today, which is uh, my second order ever from Alamo Candelaria. She's a Texas based um, indie bath company. She's based out of San Antonio and her stuff is just so gorgeous. Like it's not just soap or perfume or hand cream. Like it's, it's art really because she hand pipes all the detailing on top of her soap everything just looks so pretty so I couldn't get any soaps last time and there were like a couple um, in stock when I went back to buy some more stuff so I was able to grab a couple and I'm excited to see what they look like and show you I'll also take some pictures so that I can uh, get some pictures put in the video too so you can see it up close I know that it's not as good so here it is she um, packages up everything really cute with like black tissue and um, she always includes a little homemade lollipop. I think she makes this too. Salt Lake Lolly Salty and Sweet Confectionery Treat. So the first thing we have is one of those soaps that I was just telling you about. This one is Citron et Fig. Lemon, fig, spice, amber, and white musk with a swirl of sweet wine. This one is a goat's milk. So, so look how pretty. I don't know if you can see it, but it's wrapped in a... I don't know what kind of cloth this is. And there's like a wax seal. I almost hate to break it, but I, I really want to show you the soap. see how beautiful this soap is. It smells so good. It's not your typical, like when I thought it was going to have like some citrus and fig notes to it, I thought it was going to be really fruity, but there's something kind of ground to, grounded to this. So um, it's a more mature fruity and it smells so good. I can see like she hand molds the figs and she even takes the time to like make the inside look like a, a real fig how the flesh of the, the actual fruit is this maroon color and there's like the white seeds on the inside the different colors and then she um, puts it in as she pours and then when she slices it you get just this beautiful result and God, so good I can't wait to use it but at the same time, because it smells so good, at the same time, I don't want to use it because it's so pretty. And it's a huge bar of soap, so I think I might cut it in half to try to savor it. So pretty. Next, we have the other bar of soap that I got. Bella Bohem. This is, the name means beautiful gypsy girl. So with exotic notes of saffron, amber, frankincense, fig, sage, and tobacco rose. So feminine, exotic, and unique. Again, she has her little wax um, seal. So like part of the reason, I'll admit it, part of the reason that I bought it, I wasn't sure about, um, you know, some of the spicy notes like saff, like the herbal kind of saffron, frankincense, I was like, well, I don't know about that. But when I saw the picture online, look how beautiful, like all these rainbow colors, this turquoise pink, gold, purple, and it's like the sparkly gold with like dried flowers on top. Oh, and that smells really good, actually. They're really sophisticated scent, so you're not going to find, like, your, like, pink sugar, which she does have some, like, pink sugary scents, but she puts her own um, twist to it, which makes it different and a little bit more grown up and just kind of 
sophisticated, I guess, and it's so pretty. I'll get a close-up shot of this too, just because it's beautiful. She included a, a free candle. It says Merci, Merci. <laughs> on, the, on the bottom of the lid. So I think it was just like a little thank you gift. That smells so good. It smells like cookies and lemon. Oh my gosh, whatever scent this is, I need it. I don't know, I'm gonna have to find out, but it smells delicious. I love it. Thank you. And an extra lollipop. She's so sweet. So one of the main reasons too that I came back to order was I love the um, La Crema. It is her um, hand cream and body cream and the formula on it is just so creamy and awesome. I actually have one of these in my work bag. I wash my hands a lot, my hands get so dry. This has just really been um, kind of saving my hands from getting dry and chapped and peely from all the hand washing, and it smells really good too. This one is fairy dust, which actually I'm not gonna open this one. I think I have a really good friend and I, what we like to do is we um, order from different bath and body companies together, and then we, um, you know, like kind of do a swap or, and trade off stuff or um, split. So, Tara, here's your fairy dust. <laughs> Next, we have Citron at Fig, which matches my soap. I'm so glad I got this in the La Crema because I love the way that smells. It smells so good. is probably the matching, yep, Bella Bohemian, Bohemian to match my other soap. So I'm actually really glad too because at first I was like, well, I don't know if I'm going to even like the soap because I wasn't sure about the frankincense and I really like it. There's something that does kind of remind me of church, but not in like a, it's not like a churchy like incense scent or anything, but I just like it a lot and so I'm glad I got this. And this is for Tara too. This is let me open it and I'll just wrap it back up for her. how pretty. This is a fairy dust. Let's see. I think this is the body mist and it comes in a glass bottle. You can see like the uh, fragrance and the essential oils just mixing in there. I think it's one of those like moisturizing body mists. And look how cute with the um, rainbow ribbon. But the scent of fairy dust for, for Tara is a uh, bubblegum sugary cotton candy, sweet apples, and pears blended to perfection. I'm just gonna open this and sniff it. Hope you can forgive me, Tara. But I want, I'm curious. Oh, that smells really good. It's, like I said, it's like sh sugary when we were talking about how her stuff is not like your typical, like if she says sugary, it's not gonna be like super sweet. There's always something that kind of grounds it and makes it sophisticated and it smells really, really good. So I'm sure Tara's gonna love it and let us know what she thinks. But that's it, that's my order. And I really am impressed with her stuff. Everything that I've gotten has always been such great quality and it's really 
pretty to boot on top of it you can tell that she really cares about her products and that she's really passionate about it and I really like that when I am buying um, well anything but most especially my bath and body stuff so thank you Kim I love everything in my order and thank y'all for watching <laughs>